Hello and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is the one, the only, the ads, and we are back with Azeroth Wars. A hugely interesting game so far. Even though a few players have dropped and a few have sucked, we have still seen massive fights like of which we do not normally see. And Archimon getting into a wonderful position here is going to start wreaking havoc with his AoE abilities. Dropping another strike right on the weakened flank of this army. Tons of Rafima going down. Uh, the demons are outnumbered, however, they do have... Uh, Equal upgrades, they're just better units if you use them well. <laughs> Never. Infernal Juggernauts can drop Infernals. They're goddamn Juggernauts. Every time I drop one, I kind of want to go, I'm the Juggernaut, bitch! <laughs> it just seems strange to scream that in a room when no one else is around. Dark Iron War Golems are a good choice as they are magic immune. Oh god, this is so much feed for Archimon. Bit by bit, he is going up, he's going up. GG Red says purple. And another Nether Strike on his own units, actually. Gonna do some damage to his own guys. More damage to the enemy, though. Now level 7 Archimon. If Blue... Blue has the money to be reinforcing this, and he bloody well needs to be. He's losing his Doom Guards one by one. Needs to be using their Stomp ability. It's invaluable. And there Yellow goes, realizing, I should probably focus down Archimon. But, uh, no, Blue, no. The fight's not done. There's still a lot of fighting to be done here with Archimon. You need you need to not, unless there's a flank I don't know about that is happening and you're retreating from that because they just ran away and you're missing out on valuable feed. Okay, fine. Whatever. Where's Purple right now? High Lord Alexandros Mograine, with a few of his trusted units, is going to attempt to run away and do what little he can to survive. Oh, he's going to run right into the demons. He's like, nah, you know what? I've decided I don't want to go that way. I don't want to go that way. That's just a really bad way right now. It looks awful. Uh, Red's trying to get all up in Purple's face. Purple, where's he going to go? He should have... All right, he has, does have a transport ship. Does he have any builders? Not that I can tell. He's going to have to leave. He's going to have to choose which units to leave here. That is a brutal choice. Hold the line while we escape. <laughs> Oh, okay, he wanted the builder. He did have a peasant. Good choice there. That would have been embarrassing. I've escaped, but I can do nothing. Excellent. We have them exactly where we want. We're surrounded. Good, we can fire in any direction. That's kind of where purple is right now. Is Teal still in this game? Wait, did he ally red? Why did he ally... No, you can't have the Ashbringer who allies evil that's not what they have legion if this purple is about all right yellow's got a dwarven keep tower with all right now it has a bear <laughs> garrison but it... all right that'll work and then it won't work you think we should put units in these no no nah, that's stupid it's crazy talk keldazad is now a revivable hero as the arc lich Purple's hanging out, but god, Purple, you gotta do something here. I'm gonna speed this up, because there's really no combat at the moment. Except, I mean, you know, yellow and red and blue. I, should, I shouldn't say that, because yellow's having a hell of a time right now. Heroes are really low level compared to everyone else. Archimon, equal level, and you never want to have an Archimon that's equal or higher level than you. It's too much to deal with. Keep Tower's not doing much. Magni is trying to heal, but he's about to go down. He's trapped by his own units. He's got oh, dark green to the rescue. All right, we gotta go. We gotta go zoomed in mode for this kind of insanity. All right, the Legion is attacking. Magni has decided. You know what? I know I have a broken leg and an arm and a concussion, but I think the front lines is where I need to be right now. You know, for a king and country, and he's wandering around aimlessly. Senility is slowly creeping up on him. And, in fact, most of them aren't even attacking the old dwarf. They're like, oh, that, I feel bad for him more than anything, man. Look at him. Look at him. Murray's like, ah, uh, the older brother syndrome. Tell It's just, what are you going to do? This is a slaughter right now. Blue and red are in a wonderful position. I don't know how anyone could beat them. Gray could beat them. Gray has shown to be just a tenacious little guy. Uh, ooh, sick. God damn, Dire Carrion Beetles are good. Retreating back to his second line of Dwarven Keep Towers. We'll see what Yellow decides to do. Probably, uh, spend some of his too much money. Dark Green, are you gonna spend some of your too much money? 
Because your enemies don't have too much money. But you guys have way too much money. Oh, shit. All right. I don't know what Green's going to do, but does Teal know enough about this game to realize that he now has an elven army in his back door? No upgrades, just units. All right, Teal. All right. I respect it. I respect your life choices. I'm not going to join in, but I respect him. Archimon getting that healing he always wanted. Now he's a real boy. Purple, you gonna you gonna do anything? You gonna you gonna you gonna do anything there, buddy? We still have a lot of game left, so it's possible that Mograine enters the fray once again. But he better not do it on the side of evil, because they're clearly winning. All right, forward base now by the South Alliance, hoping to hold at these keep towers. It's a decent shot. If they get some mortar teams over here, oh, can wreak havoc. Griffins. I'm just saying, there's a lot of possibilities for this choke point. I don't think they're going to utilize almost any of them. Oh, look at that. Oh, he dropped an infernal, not on units, but as a distraction to keep it alive. That is... That is a different kind of special right there. Oh, the slaughter. Oh, God, all the chaos damage. Look at it. Why would you run into that? Why, like, as a human, would you go, yeah, this seems really good. We've got necromancers to the left. And uh, big fiery boulders to the front. Oh, did I mention the horn demon goat thing and his supporting allies? No? No? Nobody wants to? Okay. Alright, well, they're here now. And do good use of dark iron war golems. But they have no attack upgrades. So they're basically just tanks. And they're dark iron. So they don't even have the health regen. Negative armor. Blue doesn't realize they're magic immune. That's good. He just, just blew his whole, his own army up. The dwarves are probably laughing at that one. What happened to what happened to Green? All right. Does Teal know? Teal's still in the game, right? No, Teal left. His All right, that is a lot of feed waiting for somebody to show up. Uh, all right, what are you going to do, Gray? Gray, you're my last chance that this game turns interesting all of a sudden. 7 11 7 do you have anything I'll go around the way? Still lots of creeping to do. Cthune's not dead. Most of the things on the beaches are not dead. Blues? Win winning. Dark Green's gonna kill this force, but Blue's winning overall. The keep towers aren't doing much to change that. <clears throat> Magna is back from the dead. Oh, okay, that's actually really good. That's really good. See, that's the advantage of mass units. Is That spell doesn't really have a cap. The more units under it, the more healing it does. So if you have more units, better. All right. I like it. 0, 3, and 4, 4 upgrades for our South Alliance team. Zero three 3 being the dwarves. Red, what are you up to, buddy? Oh, he's flanking. And actually having a little bit of problem here as the mass militia dwarven rifleman armies. <laughs> this is a very basic army. Uh, any kind of AoE, like uh, Frostworm or two, would just destroy all the militia. Oh my god, that was one of the most satisfying things I've ever seen. Thank you. Thank you for that impale. It gave me chills. Shiv oh, oh, Frost. Oh, god. Oh, Arthas Menethil level 6 now. He's going to be racking up. Purple, what are you doing? Just watching the fights? Alright. Your hero's still level 10, right? How did you get him... The description did not imply that there was going to be this... Much of the game where Mograine was out of commission. I'm curious. if He's playing the long game, you know what I mean? He's got a plan, a strategy. He's got things going on in his brain. Are you going to go over there in a ship, or are you going to land and then TP? I don't see a TP on any of your heroes. Coplin Shredders is... Yeah, he's going in a ship. Just his hero squad? Or are you going to bring a... Ooh. A, ooh, a Nubarak. Actually, surrounded and murdered by militia. Ooh. There you go. Kel'Thuzad's got his crown. That's what I wanted to see. I gotta say, militia with their crit ability... Not, they don't suck. They do not suck. Look at them. Look at those surrounds they can get. It's crazy. Baron Rivendera, Arthas Menethil. He needs to get up some Death Knights so they can... 
have reliable death coils to keep himself alive, but they're holding. And they still have a lot of gold. Not as much as they, they've spent about 2,000. I would say that efficiency wise, they're way far behind blue and red, but they had the money to spare. And you know what? They're trying to make use of it right now. Oh, there's a flank going on. But the flank has been flanked. And now yellow is losing a lot of important units here. He does have two level 9 heroes. Did Murden die? I don't see his sexy booty. Yeah, he's dead. Dem Dogron is just so good. I got to play with him. I loved that uh, Drunken Haze summon all these guys and just mass fire breath. Whoo, that would give Witty chills. Alright, Red seems to think he's going Stormwind. Growlithe? You gonna move? Eh, where is he going? He's gonna go grab a scroll of TP, isn't he? Oh, he's getting rings. He's not even. There's no possibility in his mind that he might lose. Wait, what the fuck? Why are you allying blue too? That's not okay, purple. This Mograine better not get level 19 off of just. This is a load of crap. They've got the Legion. They've got Arthas. King Arthas, and now you're gonna ally. Don't fight them. Don't don't do this to us, Blue. Don't do this to us. Mograid's up to level eleven. Huh. 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 Gray's finally gonna get. Oh, Eternia went. But the Warsong Lumber Camp never got killed off. Light Blue is slacking, man. Come on, Gray. You cannot sit here this long. I'm. Uh, this fight is semi-interesting, sure, right? I mean, dark green and yellow, if nothing else, are being really cool with the cannon towers and the Dwarven Keep towers and the forward bases everywhere. Very aggressive, very interesting. I'm really liking how they're playing, but they're just spamming the most basic units. Militia, Riflemen. It's not losing, though, so... so I can't talk too much shit. Their upgrade should have been through the roof, though. 6-3 now on yellow. He's really going the Rifleman route. Again, mortars, uh, uh anything else? Would also be good. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Alright. Dark green sinking. Yellow's got heroes. Let's see what they can do. You gonna heal the abominations and your enemies too? It's a good choice. I like it. It's uh, it's ballsy. Is he just summoning them and not using their breath of fire ability? It. Yes. Yes. Yes, in fact, that's exactly what he's doing. They're just... Huh. Special. It's a special kind of special. I mean, they, they have good they have good attack. Decent decent health and, and armor and all that. But come on. Come on. You could be doing so much better. More efficient. Blue, no attack. He doesn't want to attack that even though there's nothing there. No attack here even though there's really nothing. God, Rife. I tell you what. If someone was spamming just Rifeman, I would be having a field day with them right now. Red is going for Stormwind, as he promised, and he has... Hold on, sorry, I was going to say no units, but he actually has probably quite... No, not that many units, actually. A Death and Decay by Kel'Thuzad could be extremely effective, but he's not high enough level, so I, I don't know what's going on here. Anubarak, surround... He's going to be killed by Militia again. Oh, it's so embarrassing. Baron Rivendare just revived, and... Will he get out of there? He's going to run. He's going to make a run for it. Yellow's still got his heroes, and really needs to heal his own guy heal your own guy do it it's good for you i swear healing make healing does the body good it's like milk but just 10 times better because it's magical it's like lawn lawn ranch milk okay it is it's like the milk bar from majora's mask good level milk just marshall spam that'll do still a lot a lot of money yellow should contribute a little bit if kelthazad gets killed here and loses his crown. Oh, God. Just more martial spam. Spearman? Their slow is really good. Uh, Priest, the heal is very, very good. Zeppelins. The fact that they can't be attacked by almost anything here. Very, very good. Oh, sorry. Yellow sent in another rifleman squad. So, things are fine. Blue wiped the floor with that. That garrison. That was embarrassing. Gorba Keep Tower is bloody everywhere. Purple, you know. Purple's fighting with the Legion. 
This is not Mograin Madness. This is this is Mograin's shame. That's what this game should be called. He would never. That no. No and no. Death Knight Mograin not okay when blue and red are clearly winning. Like they should be winning. No offense. Everything that they have, they have the advantage on. Their heroes are gonna start to get better every Alright, so he got pushed out. Oh big deal. No. Yellow price spent a couple thousand on these riflemen. Yeah, about a thousand. Alright. Gray, what are you up to? You still you still making us wait for your big entrance? Oh man, come on. <laughs> Sturdy War X. That's actually really interesting here, because if you have a hero, you could pillage your way up to having enough to start rebuilding. I think that's kind of a neat little thing. The Voodoo Dolls. It's nice on Rokan. A lot of extra mana. <coughs> Mograine's Aura, huh? Let's see what that is again. It has increased movement speed and attack rate. Yeah, yeah, basically. Oh, God, it's like bloodlust for your whole army on one hero. <sighs> Mograine's fighting for evil. Alright. I mean, I, I guess I'm gonna just have to learn to fucking accept it. It doesn't feel right. Doesn't feel good at all. And the Warsong Clan with 27 CPs? Hey, you gotta do something, right? Something interesting before the game's over. Martial Militia. This is like M and M and M, Marines, Marauders, Medivac, except it's just MMR. Marshals, militia, riflemen, and it's not. The fuck are you doing, Dark Green? The fuck are you doing? Is he trying to aim down Archimon? That is a level eleven Archimon. You are just fodder. This is the stupid. Oh, that is. Those are good Invernals too. Yeah, that's. That's a lot of dead enemies. Now the riflemen are here. Oh, good, good. After the tank line is almost completely used up, another strike should just clear that away as well. We're going to be fine. Oh, my. Do you hear them all dying? The riflemen can do damage, but not enough. Not enough. This is... This is a different... Different kind of special. It's going to start hurting more. Oh, wow. Okay, so Mograine's in there. Level 12 now. The Ashbringer is bringing a lot of ash, but to the wrong people. Perhaps it was a concussion. I, 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 don't, I don't know. I mean, red and blue already had the genuine advantage. I don't care about the control points. In this case, they have Archimonde out. They have Arthas out. They're just waiting on Lich King, and then you ally them and give them that aura and that hero, that help? That is... I'm pretty sure Davin Rare is the one who sent this in, but come on, man. You should have allied the South Alliance, or you should have allied Grey. Anybody except for the clearly winning character. Oh, no. Murden's going down. Magnet Bronzebeard, going down next. Diagron, going down next. Speed this one up. Wait, is he giving purple? Okay, surely Dark Green leaves the game now as well, right? Windsor has got to just be frustrated as hell with this situation. He's still, <laughs> he's still got his items. And he's just doing a little bit of a happy dance over here. I think he's really excited about the boats. Gray, what are you doing there, buddy? You gonna participate? This is ah, I may this may be a part. This may be a two-parter. This may very well just be a two-parter because if nothing gets better in the part three, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bring this to you guys. This the rest of this would be crap, right? If it gets better, cool. If not, I'll be out. Alright, Gray's building things. Uh, yeah, hold on. Ugh, <coughs> <coughs> oh, sorry. Gross. That is, I know it's gross, Eddie. Alright, transport ships with uh, peasants in them. 
huge complement of ships coming down here. Really, nothing in them though. There's not. There's nothing in the undead transport ship to justify this being scary. If I understand the situation correctly. Down a dollar on. Well, red. This is stupid. Kelazod might die. Mogre might. No. Anybody gonna die? That chain lightning was impressive. <sighs> All right, fair enough. Let's see what Gray's gonna do about this. He's got to do something. All right, no TP in. Barracks, barracks, Spirit Lodge. Joffrey spotted them. Kill that thing is what. It, kill that. I don't trust that thing. I want to know why that's there. Very disconcerting. What? Sorry about that. <clears throat> Alright, is Grey here yet? Alright, brought Farseers. That's a nice move. Doesn't even matter if they're 1-1. One, one. As long as they're there with Chain Heal, that is going to make Grey so much stronger. He's got... Do you have a TP? He does have ATP. Here it is. <clears throat> oh, a teleport from blue. From <laughs> from purple, actually. Okay. Here comes gray. Destroyed it. All right. That's smart not to TP in here. You just can often get bunched up. We'll see how this goes. Purple's on the front line with, with quite a bit of a blue army here, but by now gray should have... Oh, eight, seven upgrades. Holy crap. All right. So dark green's out. It is now... Alright. Isaac2314? He there, buddy? He's actually attacking Dark Green. Did he kill off... Kill off the whole... You know, I'm so sorry I missed it. Your heroes have got to be pretty high level. Kael'thas, he needs to ally Grey against the nonsense that is going on up north. Pretty sure the Horde is enjoying this fight. <clears throat> As they have a crown... Oh, the Corkon Guard summoned in the back. Where is Purple? Hopefully not right on the front lines, as he could be wiped out very quickly. He's just got one hero. Oh, wait. oh it's stuck. Oh, he's going to lose all the items if he's not careful. Guy, guys, there is a High Lord Alexandros Mograin behind your line. No way he gets away. No way. No. That was... He was behind enemy lines to the nth degree. Alright, alright, fine, whatever. Corner Guard, super strong. 16 armor, 33 to 77 damage. Alexandros Mogreen still trying to do his best here, but with almost no heals, he's going to have to be a little bit more careful. Fight continues on. Love the Goblin Shredders. 57 to 156 damage. That is why you get them. Admittedly, they do have light armor, so uh, mass range. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, Mograin just ate a big one. And Gray continues to go crazy with the feed. It has almost... He's going to have three level 10 heroes here in just a little bit. And when Rexar hits max level, you better watch out, son. There goes Animal Companions. Spirit Hawk, Bear... Ooh, look at that magic damage. 56 to 89. The fast attack speed. Very fast movement speed. He's just hacking through everything here. Red's his only real competition... Oh, shit. Oh shit, see, here's the problem. Red just wiped out his support, so he has no way of reinforcing this unless he has peasants somewhere on that continent. No, no, he doesn't. One of his heroes should have something that'll allow him to summon you. No, this is, this is not good. He needs to leave <clears throat> or focus down Kel'Thuzad. That is option number two and equally as good. Steal those items, kind of demoralize Red, and he'd be in a great position. Red's uh, not in a great spot right now. Chain heals were not utilized as much as I thought they were going to be. But Growlithe with a ton of gold that he just can't spend. He's going to slowly lose units one by one, and Red and Blue are going to continue to reinforce, and they have the money to do so. 
uh, Grain needs to figure out a way to start reinforcing this army. He needs to send... He, hell, he needs to send units. <coughs> no, still not nice ground pushing. Red, you've been talking about it so loud that Red's got plenty of units sitting around here waiting for it. Alright, come on. Purple's still dead. <laughs> Does he... He had he had a peasant. The peasant disappeared. No covet ops. I often try not to covet my neighbor's ops as well. Because, I mean, his, his wife is one thing. But his ops? Oh, that is rude. Arth he wants Arthas dead. He wants Kel'Thuzad dead more. Oh, there it is. There's the anger. You can see it. The surrounds. He's just here. Oh, he's... Okay, good night, Arthas. Alexander Smogreen back alive. Actually has a castle and is beginning to build a base over here. You know, if you weren't allied to the team that was so hardcore winning all of this, I would be giving you major props. Holy shit, Archimonde is inside there with no support. And there are crazy-ass orcs right outside. Those orc champions could surround him and kill him in no time in a flat. Oh, 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 please. Please get ballsy and just rush in there and see what's going on. I mean, even if you just want to scout. But he's, he's officially out of units. All he has left is his hero squad. Oh, oh, Mograine deciding to taunt. Being a little annoying. Not enough to actually do much. But it's enough to be annoying. <clears throat> God, I need to stop being sick. I'm so tired of being sick. Whew. Again, just just being a little bit annoying with that. He's just looking to cause the guy... He's just looking to cause trouble, let's be honest. He saw an opportunity and went for it. There we go. Now my phone's being agreeable. Now it's not. It's You know, my phone is just the biggest piece of crap. I'd love to be able to do anything with it at all. But I can't. Green could do a lot right now. Green could be talking with Gray. He could be... Jesus. <sighs> He's still allied to Purple, is what he is. And that hurts to see. He doesn't need it. Purple, they don't need your help. I swear on all the gods. The old and the new. He's good. All right, Goblin Zeppelin's got brought in, so that's, that's a thing. Just gonna watch. Gonna watch as he does... No All right, he's gonna destroy some ships. Kudos to you. Big, big, good job done there. Is this, is this a ship on the way? With Thank God. Unit producing. <laughs> oh, he's got workers. He's got the Oblid Zeppelin. He's got workers. He's 8-8 upgrades. Full All right. So he's, he's in a place where he could potentially do some damage. We're going to leave it right there. Right now, Gray is running around north, just kicking butt with his hero squad and doing quite a lot of damage. Unfortunately, hasn't been able to reinforce. His units will land soon. We'll see what he can do in part three. See you guys then. Bye.